What's up guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today is release day for the new Pokemon Sword and Shield Brilliant Star set. I was down at Walmart picking up a couple things and they actually had some of these, so I grabbed a few. This is all they had for Brilliant Stars. They had some other older stuff, but not like good older stuff. We're talking like um, battle styles and nothing really that great. So anyways, I wanted to see if they had any. They did, so I grabbed five of these. There wasn't a limit, but this is all I got. We're going to go ahead and give this a try, see what all the fuss is about. <clears throat> From what I've seen open on this stuff, this stuff is jam-packed with uh, alternate arts, full arts, this new stuff called Trainer Gallery Cards, which is a whole different subset. Uh, they've got, um, yeah, all, all sorts of really awesome things. Of course, Charizard's in this. Uh, secret rare rainbow charizards alternate art charizards i mean there's a lot of big time stuff in this that looks really really nice some really good artwork so let me just go ahead and get I'll get all these out of the uh cardboard here and then we'll start ripping into them and see if we can't get something the loose five loose packs like this from these i don't know what do you call them value packs or hanger packs or whatever you want to call whatever pokemon calls them not expecting anything at all so if we do get anything then it'll be a bonus. Um, so let's go ahead and rip into this. Let's see what we get. There is our five packs. That's basically three packs shy of a of an Elite Trainer box. Um, so here we go. First pack, we do have a Charizard. Actually, that Charizard was in a... This alt art pack art was in a different... I think it was in this one. So maybe well, let's save the Charizard pack for last. Why not? Because that was a little bit... A little bit strange, and that where we know obviously we're looking for him, so we'll save that one for last and see if we there's some last pack mojo in that bad boy. All right, here we go. Pack number one, and we do have a white border pack. I don't remember if that matters in this set or not from what I saw open, but so we'll see, anyways. Ultra Ball. This is a very anticipated set based on the people I've seen on YouTube and watch guys like Poker Rev and stuff. It's, just been absolutely loving this stuff, so we'll see if we get in on the action as well. Clang Reverse Hollow and Manfi Not Hollow Rare. All right, oh yeah, and there's the code card. Now that these are out, that should work. All right, pack number two. Okay, another white code card. Three, four, Marnie's Pride, Grottle, it's like a, it looks like a cross between a turtle and, or tortoise and a uh, Chia Pet. And we do have our first Trainer Gallery card, nice, in a white pack nonetheless, and Luxray, that's cool, full art, the art in this stuff is really fantastic, man, I didn't grab my sleeves again, this, I, this is a common occurrence for me. I literally was going to grab them too before I started this video and then I just plain forgot. So we have a Dedeni? Dedeni? I don't know how to say that. But the art artwork on that is cool. And then you see the, the, the hollow on that foil. It's really, really cool. And this is the um, TG. I think that stands for Trainer Gallery. There's a 30 card subset of this. This is card number seven of that subset. So we did get one thing. I don't know. You know, by the time people start opening up this, this stuff like crazy, I'm sure these things are going to become, you know, a lot more common. But for right now, they're obviously brand new. So that's pretty neat that we got something at least. All right. And we got another white code pack. Obviously, the last pack for the trainer gallery cards anyways did not matter because we still got one even in the white pack. Magma Basin. Make sure all these up high enough for you guys here so you can see them. Bidoof, Electrabuzz, Chimicho, Reverse Hollow, Non-Rare of Sigil, I don't even know how to say that, Sigafliff, I don't even know, and Non-Hollow Rare of Wormdam, Wormdam, however you say that, Wor Wormadam, sounds like a swear word. All right, two packs left, so far no full arts, no V cards, no V maxes, none of that stuff, no secrets, there's another white code card, so far we are... Probably 0 for 4. 4. Choice Belt. Vibrava. Shinix. Magmar. I've heard of him. 
Spiritome, Spiritum, I don't know. Tornadus, that's a reverse hollow rare. It's a cool looking artwork. And Askew, all right, so last pack. Did we save the best for last with the Charizard? Let's find out. Like I said, the artwork was not matching the outside one. And it's another white one, so I don't think we're actually going to get anything out of this, unfortunately. But you never know. Let's see. Let's find out. Uh, Gabite, Mincino, Baltoy, Snorunt, <laughs> Nosepass. Why do they come up with these names? Uh, Milkry, we got a Reverse Hollow Magmar, and Mewtwo non Hollow Rare. That's a cool artwork, though. So that's it, guys. Um, yeah, we we unfortunately we kind of struck out on the the bigger cards, right? Like the the uh, sorry the full arts and the V Maxes and the secret rares and gold cards and all that crazy stuff. But we did get one of the trainer gallery cards, so we got at least something kind of full art related out of those five packs. It's really cool looking artwork. The Denny. Um, looks pretty good overall on the back. Um, so yeah, there you go, guys. That's our first look at the new Sword and Shield Brilliant Stars Pokemon set. Uh, thanks as always for watching, and be sure to hit the like, subscribe if you like the content, and uh, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you thought. Have you opened any of the Brilliant Stars yet? And if you have, have you gotten anything good? Thanks again, guys, and I will see you on the next video.